Genesis 10, Genesis 10 verse 9. It says, I'm going to start from verse 8. And Cush begot Nimrod, and he began to be a mighty one on the earth. And he was a mighty hunter before the Lord. Wherefore it is said, even as Nimrod, the mighty hunter before the Lord. You know, guys, you guys know that Nimrod was wicked? He was a wicked king, if you read the book of Joshua. He was a wicked king, but he got a hold of this mantle, this clothing that was made by God to clothe Adam. And it gave him power. It gave him supernatural power, but he used it for evil. So later on, it was passed down, and then later on, uh, Noah, Noah received it, and it just kept going to, to different, different uh, people. What is that called? Power transfer. Power transfer. Power transfer. God wants to give to you today a power transfer. Amen. Amen. A power transfer is greater than a wealth transfer. You know what a power transfer can do? What a power transfer can do is it can command the fish to spit out money. That's called a power transfer. What power can do is it can multiply two fish and five loaves. There's a man of God by the name of uh, Prophet Uber Angel. God gave him the power to do miracle money. Yeah. So in his services, money appears <laughs> in people's wallets, people's accounts, people's purses. Yeah. That's called power. Amen. Now it's one thing to sow a seed yeah. and you get a harvest. Mm -hmm. But that's, that's wealth transfer. Power transfer, you don't sow a seed. You create money. Literally. I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. 